Hello, everyone. Access to palliative care varies within and across provinces and territories. Health Canada held a consultation about palliative care from May through July, and the college was invited to provide the family medicine perspective. Health Canada's report is due to be released in September. Here are some key points highlighted in the college's submission. Palliative care requires services at multiple levels of care to meet the needs of patients and their families. Most palliative care can be provided in the community by family physicians and other primary care colleagues. To support this approach, we need palliative care education across the family medicine learning continuum, support from other specialists, home care resources, and appropriate remuneration models. The amount of time that undergraduate and postgraduate training programs across the country devote to palliative care varies. The college's triple C curriculum surveys have shown that more than half of family medicine residents believe they did not receive enough undergraduate training in this area. About 30% of residents also feel that palliative care training was inadequate in their residency programs. More work is needed to guide curriculum and policy development. Please be assured that we are aware of this and that we are working to address it. Many regions across Canada do not have adequate numbers of clinicians with additional palliative care training. The CFPC recognizes family physicians with enhanced skills and expertise in palliative care with certificates of added competence. When they are supported with appropriate models of care and compensation, family physicians with CACs in palliative care can help other colleagues in this work, which means fewer unnecessary visits to the emergency department, fewer acute care hospitalizations, and more patients being able to die in the comfort of their homes. If you have thoughts about other ways of enhancing palliative care in Canada, please send me a message by email or Twitter. Until the next time, take good care.